Okay, today's date is the 30th of April, Tuesday, quarter to eight in the morning. So I've um, just come off night shift. I've got one more night to go. Uh, and um, when I did the upload, my upload for my last vlog, I did the upload and then realised, saw that I hadn't posted, in, in, done any videos for um, two weeks. That was actually a bit of a surprise for me because like I've been posting semi-regularly, at least one a week, maybe even more. But um, it made me realise how much of a state I was in um, for the fortnight. And people noticed me missing, which is thank you for all those that have commented both on my um, on my comments on YouTube, plus also when I've been on, managed to join into a couple of lives. So um, thank you. It's good to be noticed that, good to have someone notice that I'm not around. Um, I've changed the angle of the camera. I'm using, I'm not using my desk. I'm using my webcam, not the computer camera. So hopefully this will solve the issue with um, with the recording, which is what I was struggling with last fortnight. So I've still got tasks I've got to try and achieve within the next two weeks. One of them is to complete that Black Forest cake uh, recipe and upload that. I am going to also be doing another cake for my crew that I currently work with, who I am leaving. I'm going to a changing crew, so I'll make them a, my old, my, the crew I'm with now, I'll make them a cake to say farewell and yeah. Um, what else have I got to achieve? I've got to tackle that resin and finish that resin off. And I also have to order the drills for the custom, which is on a blank canvas. So I'm, I ordered a blank canvas from Huracan. Uh, it's a 120 by 70 blank canvas. So for, for squares, I've just got to order the drills. I've got my pattern all picked out and ordered, or, or got that organised. So I've got to order those drills. Um, and I've stopped and looked at what I did for the last fortnight that um, kind of got me procrastinating so well. One of the things I actually did do, it's so instead of doing stuff like it doing the editing these I actually made sure all my de kidding so if you can see all of that that is all my um, spare drills including nice big one of 310 so that's where you can see that's one of the things I procrastinated about um, because I initially had this set up for the custom that I first planned to do and then I've changed my mind. I don't want to do that one. I've changed the picture. Okay, so that's things I want to do. Um, Nathan's going fishing for a week so I have peace and quiet at home um, and no interruptions. What else for the fortnight? Um, I don't know whether you've got it in over in the US or anywhere else. We have U Foods in Australia. Um, and they've got like pre-packaged pre meals and they're, they're fresh. They're not frozen, they're fresh. I'm actually going to be ordering from them uh, while Nathan's away. So I'm going to order a week's worth of food. And... Um, so then I don't have to worry about cooking for one person. Um, so yeah, and I'm contemplating videoing it and putting it up there. But yeah, I mean, it's um, U Foods is pretty cool. I'll put their link to their web page in uh, the vlog. But I'm actually working on looking at trying out their 70-30 diet that they have, which... Um, is basically 70% of the meals are all planned and under 350 calories and then 30% is 
um, are 350 or above and you don't have to go with that you can just have five days of calorie controlled food and then have uh, two days of eating what you like um, so yeah I'm looking at doing that and that will be the ordering on Wednesday so while he's away for a week fishing I won't have to worry about cooking out any meals even though I will be baking the cakes so yeah um, I like to bake don't like to cook uh, so yeah next um, I'll probably catch, catch, chat to you in a, another couple of days uh, I'm going to try and keep these vlogs short um, and I think I'll start doing some more whipping chats now um, so yeah so I will uh, talk to you in probably a second or two okay today's date Thursday 2nd of May 9 o'clock in the morning um, Nathan goes fishing tonight he's due back Friday week um, now I procrastinated last week and did, did I put it? Um, I sorted all my drills out I put all my leftover drills <coughs> so what I did last night was I after organizing the drills last fortnight I then sorted out my drills for the custom that I'm going to do from scratch so um, hopefully you can see this do no I'll get the camera. so this is the custom from scratch Ooh, do, 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 do. get the camera right okay so that's going to be on a 120 by 70 blank canvas I ordered the drills last night from Stitches to Stones. It cost about just under 150 Aussie dollars uh, for 82 different colours. This diamond painting takes 103 colours. Um, but because of my leftover drill situation, I only need to order 83. Okay, so that's that side. What else? Um, U Foods. I mentioned that on my last recording in this vlog I ordered that last night and it's due to arrive today one of the great things about them you order by 5 p.m. and then um, it arrives the next day I don't know what time because this is the first time buying it so uh, contemplating unboxing it and just doing a, a thing on the U food um, and although I don't want to do like I'm trying not to copy other youtubers but some of the stuff they do I find quite interesting and helpful so um, and stitch rooster it, she does her weight loss plan or meal plan that um, you know it helps kind of hold you into place of what you know of, of being um, good I suppose as good as you can be um, so I'm thinking about doing doing the same thing or similar um, and what else have we got going on I don't know if anything else is DP a thon so DP a thon 5th of May I've got the 5 a.m. time slot which is actually 5 p.m. here so it's a great time for me um, so I'm going to do that, see how we go. I won't have to worry about Nathan going in or out and I, mean, I wanted to attend the last, I put my name down for the last one and then um, couldn't do it. Um, I think I mentioned I wanted to do it but hadn't locked in the time slot and then stuff happened with Nathan's sister. So that went by the wayside. Um, so yeah, I will chat to you on another day. Today's date, Tuesday, 7th of May. Um, you can probably see it, I've been hit by a migraine this morning. Didn't make it into work, I was at the point of, um, yeah, I was very sick. No, I'm still not 100%. But, um, 
two pair of thumb was on the weekend, which was really good. Uh, good to be a part of something that you know is so, I suppose, so seen by so many. Um, got to talk to people that I've had not seen before, and I actually found some new channels of um, YouTubers that are you know, only got small channels, which is really good, really good. Um, got two orders I'm waiting on, which I expect to receive tomorrow. One is um, a blank canvas, so that's in Perth now, it's at the, at the um, warehouse. So that was ordered the 7th of April, so, sorry, 4th of April. So that'll be four and a half weeks, and I'm waiting for, I expect the DAC as well to arrive tomorrow. Uh, that was ordered the 17th of April. Excuse me, I haven't been out of bed for so long. Um, and that'll be three weeks of um, waiting for that one. So, um, yeah, just a little bit of a wait. Uh, look forward to getting both of them. And eventually I'll stop saying anything about waiting for the orders. <laughs> Mine, I have ordered the drills, and I think I've mentioned that. So I've ordered the drills for blank canvas. They're on their way. Um, let's see how long they take. So they can, they're not from the US, they're from China as well, but it was ordered from a US company. Um, well, I believe to be US anyway. Their website is US. Um, I think that's about it. Done my couple of chocolate spring roll, the Swiss rolls for work. Didn't record it. I've decided that I'm not going to put any baking up. Um, for me, it's just the editing on the baking is just really hard. Um, although, like with a, a live unboxing, oh, come a live unboxing is done in one shot and you can't go back. Um, baking is basically done in one shot per stage, but you can't go back either. But to try and put them together, it just, yeah, I was under a little bit with the Black Forest cake, so I decided I won't put any baking up. I'll, I'll just enjoy watching other people doing cooking and getting ideas off uh, their YouTube accounts. So I'll leave that there. Um, oh, no, Nathan's due back tonight. So they weren't due back till Friday night. Uh, coming home early, I got a message yesterday afternoon. They're coming home early because of weather shit. So, um, yeah, I'm back to having a bit selective when to what I can do on some recordings. Um, so, yeah, uh, see you in the next, next uh, exciting episode. Okay, today's date Thursday, 9th of May. I'm back to work tomorrow with my new group. A crew, which is the original crew I started working with when I first went into IRO. But, so this will be my last recording. I'll update this, um, upload this tonight. So you'll see it tomorrow, which is Friday for me, but probably Thursday for you. Working in the past to, to put something in the future that you'll see in the past. I so love living in, the, in Australia to be able to say something like that. Now, I've been waiting for a couple of things to arrive. Two packages have arrived. I'll go into more detail into that, into the unboxing, which I will actually release after this. What I will say is, one of those I ordered 17th of April. One, two, three, and today's the ninth. So that's three weeks ago. 22 days ago it took to get here. Um, yeah, I've heard other people in Australia get this 9, 10 days. So 22 days when you're actually having to pay for freight, you would expect it a bit quicker. Paying for freight to get something, you should get it quicker, regardless of where it's going to. 
I have sent, purchased something from the States before and I received it in 10 days. So something is wrong with the freight company they're using for that to happen. So yet again, I'll say another company that I brought from in the US, I got it within 10 days. This is 22 days and I paid more for freight. So not happy with that. And I will say everybody is really wrapped about this company and I will wait and give my judgment when I open it. But 22 days to get Diamond Art Club. There's no delay in customs. I've been tracking it and watching it and waiting for it. No delay in customs. I have a really, really good... Sorry, I just thought that was my other half coming home. I have a tracking um, system that is brilliant for me, how brilliant for Australia. And this is something that I tracked via DHL, which is where it was delivered. And maybe I sh this is not the time to say this. This should be more in the time for... Um, Uh, should be more along the lines of when I do the unboxing of it. So I'm looking at DHL, which is who who did it. They received the order uh, the 17th of April. Processed on the 18th. Process completed on the 19th. Loaded for transport on the 24th. Five days waiting to load for transport. Another three days to export the facility. On the 27th of April, 3rd of May, it arrived in Australia. It then cleared customs. It took only three days to clear customs. Three days to clear customs. So it is, however it was set, it's the, it will be the transport company, but I tell you what, they've, it's been, arrived at DHL on the 18th. And it didn't leave there till the 27th. Nine days it sat there waiting. Nine days. It's ridiculous. But um, I'm pissed off at that. I've been watching everybody else doing their unboxings, thinking I'll get mine in about 10 days. 22 days. Paying for freight. As I said, I bought from another company in the US. I received it within 10 days. I paid less for freight for that one and I got it in 10 days. This is 22 days. This is ridiculous. But the other one I received is this big boy, which is my blank canvas. So I'll do an unboxing of that very shortly. My partner's come home, so I will continue this recording. When he's finished, um, I'm going the hell out of me. Okay, so uh, he's disappeared out the front while he's out full driving, out camping. He uh, killed his alternator, <laughs> so he's uh, just come home with the new alternator. He's going to put it in his car. Yay, peace and quiet. So, so um, yeah, I was oh, I've calmed down a bit because uh, I don't just picked up that um, package. Um, and yeah, my other big one. So this is seventy centimeters by one twenty blank canvas. So that'll be an exciting one, and I'll unbox that. Unbox that, and I'll show you shortly. Um, this is normally where I go. This is what I've achieved. So hang on. So my achievements for the fortnight. I did two cutting boards. Both have the um, have been the work that I did on this one and the other one, which was a gift from a friend. Um, both of those are actually uploaded. So. It's quite pretty, that's come out quite nice. I was a bit nervous about these edges, but that's that's okay. So this is now set and um, it's actually now living in my kitchen. I haven't used it yet, but I will. Okay, now I completed this little loop. So this is quite pretty. Um, and did pop up my post review on this one. Now this 
popped. This had popping drills. So now it's it's um, it's pretty stiff now because I actually have to use oops, the aqua glue, glue on it. And I did a big section of it and then I was actually get, getting frustrated with it but I was like, no, I won't worry about it, won't worry about it. And then I got down to this section and I was they were just coming off. So I aqua glued it. Since then I've got nothing has come off, but I will say, uh, where is it? Hang on, I'll find it. Here we've got some popping up again. So um, this one has to go under resin. There's no doubt about that. I'll pop that one down gently. What else have I done? So I have done, uh, I've actually done two whip and chats for this guy. Um, woo. Okay. No, that was just screw sitting on top. Um, I've done two whipping chats for this guy. However, I've only done, only uploaded one. So you'll get the other one in the next couple of days. It's starting to look really good. Does look like the picture. Really does look like the picture. Ah, go away. Ah, no. Go on. Okay, this one. Now this is the one that I ordered from Wish. My disappointing Wish order. This was supposed to be rhinestone. Buddy, go, go, go. It was sniffing a box. Like a male dog sniffs, sniffs a post. Okay, so this is the one I got as a disappointment um, from Wish. Got a full refund on this, so I've been working on this. The... The glue is on here is very slippery. So I was working on this section here and I was, they're still moving. These are moving um, just by a little touch. Uh, what I have done, I put the aqua glue on this section. I um, haven't aqua glued this section because I want to go over it and make sure that everything is in its right place. So it's not too bad, it's a partial. And considering the two down to the fact that it's cost nothing um, and it's a round partial so this is one of the, this is a one that I do just for a, I'm going to bed in half an hour or an hour or so I'll just do a couple of little bit of this so that's another one and then we have this one so this one was uh, round drill <laughs> This one is the one from Diamond Painting 911. Still got a little bit of a indentation, but not really much. And I did this during the DP a thon. So that's, I'm actually really liking the look of that. And as I think it was. Anna was saying, um, you don't see those animals in the air. Was it Anna? No. Kathy. Um, where are we? Sorry, I'm just trying to find the comments that were made about it because it made me chuckle. Um, it was Anna. Yeah, I was right. But one of the things she goes, Diamond Rush, thank you, by the way, I love your picture, but I must say we never saw that many different species together when we were in Africa. I have to agree. But then you look at this line, this line down, they're pretty well fed, so they're not going near them. Um, and you can really, you can see it. Um, I will say this is a horror in a couple, in a longer lines of letters. Um E's and F's bring you up to try and see if you can see it. Okay, we I've got the camera in new position so I can't really see where I'm going with it. Um, what's happening is E's and F's are basically the same. The, the colour you see is not the box, it's the actual 
edge of the box. That's what, what you're seeing. The letters and everything behind it is basically um, no real tint to it. But E's and F's together are shocking. And I've got, let's see if I can find it down this way because I can show you these. I think that looks like one section. I should be able to show you this. Okay, let's get on the right angle. <laughs> no. And well, the other one was Z7 and 2. Um, you look at the chart, and these are actually got colours for the background on the chart. No, there's no that colour's not on the background. It's around the squares. Um, so that's my achievement. Things that I've achieved, I will say, I attended the DPathon, which was a absolute blast. Really enjoyed it, um, and. My channel is growing slowly, which is, re I'm really happy that it's growing slowly. Um, I've got 431 subscribers. Um, I'm looking at doing a giveaway when I hit the 500 subscriber mark. What I'm actually looking at is um, possibly the leopard that I'm doing. This custom leopard, I might offer that as a custom, so a 40 by 50 custom of this from Evermoment. This is not Evermoment, by the way, but a custom from Evermoment, I think I do. Or a custom of their choice, um, a 40 by 50 custom of their choice from Evermoment. Um, so yeah, that's what I've achieved for the um, fortnight. I'll get this uploaded. Then Thank you for watching. Please comments if there's anything that you like that I'm doing that you want to see more of. Um, I think I have mentioned that I've decided not to do the baking. It's just way too hard and there's no really, I enjoy the baking. But the actual putting the video process together for a bake is too hard. And this is what I do. For, I'm doing this for a hobby, not for an income. I'm in heck, I'm home. Not even 450 subscribers. I am years off having enough subscribers to worry about an income. That is not my aim of doing the YouTube. The aim of doing the YouTube was to share stuff that I enjoy doing. And I do. I enjoy putting stuff on YouTube. But I just wasn't enjoying putting, a, putting together the baking stuff on YouTube. So I'm not going to do it. Um, so, yeah, please, I will say a big thank you to everybody that has posted and made comments on my channel Viv, Long Night Time No See um, and Dearly See you when I see you um, Miss you in your comments um, Yeah, thinking of you and I think we, all, we notice you're not around you're leaving a little bit of a gap but We'll see you when we see you and um, everyone, thank you for watching. Please, thumbs up, thumbs down. Actually, that's what I do have. I have someone, I'm getting some thumbs down and I don't know why, <laughs> but there are only one. The last, this last fortnight, I have uploaded five videos and four of them have the thumbs down. So, just a single thumbs down, so someone's having fun. Okay. Oh well. So yeah, please like, subs, uh, please thumbs up, thumbs down, subscribe, hit the bell if you want to be notified. Um, yeah, if I'm doing something right, let me know. If I'm doing something that's not right, let me know as well. Um, but I'm here to share and um, share my knowledge um, of what I've learnt and my journey on life. So bye for now.